Hello, welcome back to Me With Margaret, a platform, a fantastic place where we look at subjects that impact on our mental well-being, that promote good things about us as a community, that can help us improve our lives for us and our children. It's about motivation, education and engaging. In our last video, we looked at the subject hidden shadows, which highlighted the hidden messages and the nuances behind some social media content that can cause damage to the mental well-being of our children and our young people. The invisible threat is another negative impact of social media on our young people. So let's watch. Maya, what's been bothering you lately? Is something going on? Mum? Yes? Someone, someone wants to meet me and I'm scared. What did you say? Someone wants to meet me and I'm really scared. Okay. Okay, Maya, you did the right thing by telling me. I'll handle this and ensure you're safe, okay? Hi, this is 999 Emergency. How can I help you today? Hello? Is this the police? Yes. How can I help you today? My daughter's been approached online by someone with malicious intent. We need your help. Okay, ma'am. Can I have the name and the age, please? Yes, I can share everything we have. It's essential to protect her from this person. Okay. I'm afraid okay. I'll have to send an officer. Okay, thank you. Bye-bye. Maya, let me see it first. What? What do we do, Mum? I don't, I don't know. Hello? We, we need immediate help. Someone's threatening my daughter. We can't wait any longer, please. Now there is an officer on his way to you. Maya is now being targeted and threatened, which is scary for her and her mom. One good thing we notice is that she is not alone. But this is not the case with some other young people, you know. Social media has some good, but we also need to be honest enough to acknowledge its negative impact. Stalking, identity theft, personal attacks and misuse of information are some of the threats social media users face. Many times, the users risk exposure to these threats by sharing content that should not be in the public domain. Just because a threat is on social media does not diminish the risk associated with it. We need to take those threats as seriously as physical threats. If you have watched this video, I am interested to know your suggestions on how you think it should end. Be that storyteller and give us an ending to The Invisible Threat. I look forward to hearing from you.